Now let's start replacing the if functions with the functions we've mentioned. In the first part, we're gonna replace the if function with a simple VLOOKUP and this will do for the bonus for the reaching the target. So here, as you can see here, we've got the level which he was supposed to reach our sales rep and what he has reached and this is the execution. On the basis of this execution with a very complicated formula using the ifs, we assigned the bonus. The bonus is assigned roughly like this. So if he has got from zero to 30% of realization of his target, he gets 2000 uh, US dollars per month. If the execution is between 30% and 50%, then he gets eight. If between 50 and 80, then seven, and above 80%, it's 12. Because he got 89, so this is above 80%, he got 12. As you can see, doing it with if, it is possible, yet it is very, very complicated. We can do it much, much faster and in a much easier way. Uh, moreover, if you do it with ifs, then whenever you want to change the formulas or add, for example, another interval, then it gets really complicated. So how we do it with the VLOOKUP? So I put VLOOKUP and I basically tell him to look for this value, so the value on the basis of which we, we give the bonus, the percentage of execution, in the table we have created here. And I take all the table, so all the table. I don't use the specific uh, rows because I want to uh, make it more universal. So if I decided to put new intervals, I want this to be open. So I just put all the columns. And now I want to tell him that he should check by intervals and he should um, take from the third column, so the bonus. So this will be f three, because this is where we put the number of the column. Since I want him to go through intervals, so like this, I should put here the one, which is the approximate match. As you can see, we got exactly the same number as with using if, but it took me just a fraction of, of the time, which would take you to do it with ifs. In a similar manner, I can replace um, the ifs I used here. So the very simple if for the bonus for making the training. So I put VLOOKUP, then I tell him look for the value which I put here in the different table. So in this case, it was the training. Again, I can put it the whole columns and I put him two because I want him to take from the second column. But here, because this is exact match, so there are no intervals, I put zero, not one. And this is how I get exactly the same formula. Here it's actually not that necessary, so you don't have any savings in time, but it looks quite okay, I would say. So as you can see, we've replaced very complicated ifs and the simple ones with the VLOOKUP function. In this case, it was VLOOKUP using the approximate match, so going through intervals and taking the values from this table and here we took it from a simpler table and uh, we used the uh, exact match moreover by using the VLOOKUP I made it um, more flexible so I can put here new intervals here and I can put new uh, values here as well and this will not require me to change the formula I've used here.